Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here and you have not um, joined me before, then please subscribe down to the bottom. I would really appreciate it and hit that notification bell for new videos weekly. My name is Shakita, if I didn't already say that, because this is all new to me, so I'm probably forgetting information that I should be putting in here. Let's go ahead and get started. Uh, one note that you guys should know, it, when ordering from Sinrev, it doesn't matter how much you spend um, on their website, they always require a signature. So when you order from them, definitely make sure that you will be home because I was home, they rang the doorbell, I had no idea that somebody was even here. So it was delivered by United States Postal Service and they left a note on the door saying that they came and then I had to actually wait until the following day to receive the bag. So do not miss the postman. Okay, and so the thing that I like about their company is that I believe that you can make payments on the bag um, as well. And the other thing that I really love about this Zenrev company is that they are up and coming. It's a new brand, so they do not charge any tax on their bags, which is oh, just amazing. Today, we are just going to focus on the Coda bag because I just think it's such a gorgeous, gorgeous bag and that it just deserves its own video. So without further ado, I am going to unbox the Coda bag. Okay, so I already cut open the box because I am such a klutzy person. <laughs> Comes with this really, really cute um, tissue paper that says Sin Red, and it has like a little black octopus on there. And then it comes with, um, I haven't seen this in here before, but looks like it comes with like a little card. Okay, so here's the bag. Is the bag oh my gosh it is just super super stunning on the website this bag doesn't look as attractive as it does in person I promise you if you buy this bag you will love it um, the piece is gorgeous and I will be popping up a few photos here is a photo I'm going to pop up of the it is by my swimming pool I do not have anything fur or, or faux fur around here that I could pop up on videos I see some people put stuff on the thing and it looks so so gorgeous and um, I just thought that I would just use what I had which was my jacket <laughs> so I used my jacket I popped it up on my pool up there and here is a stunning photo of it I love this um, zipper. Oh my gosh, it's like super, super chunky. It, I am definitely a silver hardware girl. Um, I don't like gold or I don't care what color or tone it is. It's just personally not for me. I love how it has these two zippers here and you just pop these open and I'm guessing that strap is in here and it is. So yeah, here's the strap. Ooh, this is super super cute yeah this is just darling um, I love how it has like the microfiber interior in here it's like an ice gray color that's what it kind of looks like like it, or like an ice blue it's cute and I love how it has like the sin rev like right here in the bag um, I bought this bag basically because I will probably wear it as a clutch I'm not so much into belt bags, but I will pop up um, a few videos or a few, few pictures. As right here, you could see I'm wearing the belt bag as like in gym clothing, as if I was going to the gym. I think it would be cute if you were going to the gym, you could pop this on and it would um, make your outfit look adorable. Picture of me wearing the bag in a pair of shorts. As you can see, it's very stylish. It's super, super cute together. And I happen to be wearing um, these loafers as I was talking about um, from uh, Target. These are just super, super, super cute. They are um, $24.99, which is like a still. They look very fancy, even though the 
they are expensive and that's what I go for. I go for classic pieces that are maybe inexpensive that I pair with like an expensive um, handbag or something and it just pulls the whole look together. You don't need to spend a lot of money to look stylish. This is so versatile you can go from waking up wearing this bag to wearing it literally um, to a dinner date or out to the comedy club or any place that you would be going to in the evening um, and you could put it under your arm like this or just hold it like this if you're doing it as a clutch. I saw the bag the other night on a Prada site and they are coming out with this same exact style so perhaps the style is in and people just aren't catching on to it yet but do not sleep on this bag because it is super super affordable versatile and it is adorable. I mean the blush color to me is just fantastic. Yeah, so if you like this video and you would like to see more content from me regarding my handbags because I am a collector of handbags, I do have um, other bags that I'm going to be unboxing from Sinrev. I also purchased, actually I'm just going to do it now, This I actually purchased as well with this one, um, this little clutch. And I'm probably going to use this like in my bag as like just like something I could just store my stuff in. I don't know if I will wear it as a clutch, but I probably will. We'll see. And this just unzips and it looks like it comes with like a little strap here that says Sin Red in silver. And I just love, love this color. It's ice blue and you just pop these little straps on right here. You just kind of bend it, pop as you heard that snap in and you just hold the bag like this. Um, every time I think of like little bags like this and clutches, I always think of like the Duchess um, because they always wear like such cute little bags and um, I just love the way that they style and hold their bags like super super ladylike. So yeah, but yeah, this is this is adorable. This was $125, super super affordable. Um, this is in the pebble and this is um, the strap, it turns into a bracelet. So here is the bracelet. It looks pretty darn fancy. Very and classic. I don't think that these bags right here will ever go out of style. I see that I would be wearing these bags for years and years to come, maybe even decades. Because um, everything that I purchase in my collection, handbag wise, I see myself wearing over and over again throughout throughout my life. I don't see like, I don't like buying trendy bags because um, I'm not into trends and I feel like trends will just go away and I'm not going to buy something trendy just so I could um, make a video of it and post it and, and something like that. I'm just not into that. I'm, to me that's kind of like bakery and uh, I'm not into it. So I buy stuff that I know that I personally will buy and that I love, love, love. So for anybody who thinks that this is sponsored, this video is absolutely not sponsored. I don't even have enough subscribers on my channel to have anything sponsored because I am just new and just starting out so um, yeah it's not a sponsored video but anyways this bag is gorgeous um, if you like this bag and you like my content please go ahead and subscribe to the bottom I would really really appreciate it and thank you for joining me um, with this unboxing and I hope to see you guys again four different ways on the website they do not say that this bag can be worn as a clutch which really is kind of missing um resemble a um, sunglass case and if it is a sunglass case it is for a giant okay because it is I don't know who would be putting sunglasses in there be wearing sunglasses that big in these pictures so you just go ahead and take this strap and 
you just loop it through these two holes back here. And then I'm just going to pull this around like this. And then you would just take, sorry guys, this is very, very awkward. Um, this positioning and holding, um, holding this bag. And then you would just, every so often, but if I'm wearing a heel, it needs to be only about two inches high. That's as about as high as I'd like to go for a high heel shoe because I am just not into um, heels like that. I don't find them comfortable whatsoever and I'm all about comfort. Comfort, comfort, comfort for me. 